I'm Allison Tipton, and I want to be an Invisible Children roadie. <laughs> It's always been the things that I know other people can view as awkward. There's this one tree in Balboa Beach that I've always called a derpy tree. And it, it's super skinny where all these other trees are these like luscious, gorgeous palms. And it's so silly and goofy, but I love this tree. It brings some sort of meaning to something so mundane. The television character that I identify with the most is Lily from the show How I Met Your Mother. She's this very silly goofball, but behind all that she has this like underlying desire to make a difference with her art and at one point she spur of the moment goes to San Francisco to try to pursue her career in art and though she ends up coming home she goes out and she has this journey to try and find herself and it's something I can hugely relate to. I've always felt the need to escape my everyday life and I'm hoping that through working with invisible children not only can I help others but I can indirectly figure out my own meaning as well as hopefully guiding some other people towards there. One of the most absolute rewarding experiences in my life was finally being given the opportunity to be a big sister. About a year ago, a little bit more, we figured out that one of my family members had had a kid and she was not capable of raising it. My dad had picked up this little boy named Raymond and immediately fell in love with him. He looked that social worker in the eye and he said, we'll take it. This is our kid. Don't let me stop you. We adopted Raymond and a couple months later his little brother Reese was born and we've actually taken them both in and they're just the most beautiful little creatures and I never knew how much caring for someone and loving someone that much could change you as a person. If I go on the road with any influential person, it would actually be with my mom because my mom and I have a really bizarre friendship. We're kind of freakishly the same person. She's gone through more than most people that I know and she is one of the strongest people I've ever met. And I strive so much to have that kind of strength and I know having the opportunity to go on an adventure with her, I know we could just swap stories and just really create even more of a connection than we already have.